Hi all. Here, here's a video for a chopper. Got it at the Walmart. It's uh, just under 20 bucks, I think. 19 and some change. Uh, there was two of them there. One for $9 and one for 20 I like this one because it holds three cups. Uh, here it says three cups. The, the one we had that just broke, it was a smaller one. And I, I know I, I would have to mix half of it, dump it, then put some more food in, crush it, and do it again. So I was kind of glad to see the three cup item. So three cup bowl, stainless steel blade, two speed settings. So that's going to be nice. I have a blender from GNC and it does nothing but purify. It turns everything into like water. And then in includes a whisk attachment and spatula. So that's the stuff here. Okay. It's always nice to stick your fingers in there. That always helps. Right? <laughs> so this <laughs> This side is Spanish. Okay. A three cup chopper. This basically says the same as the front. Okay. So let's open it up and check it out here. <laughs> yeah, those are sharp. Hey, it's broke. It's upside down. <laughs> Nothing else in there. A piece of foam. Bag. This one's probably twice the size of the other one that we had. It's pretty big. Short cord. It would have been nice to have a cord just a little longer. It's real small spatula. And uh, let's see how this works. I guess it helps to read to read the manual, right? Mm-hmm. So it twists off here. Here's high button and low button. So I I, I suppose you you have to stand there. You know you can't just turn it on and walk away from it. tape. Tape. <laughs> Okay, so that just slips right off. Here's here's the blade. So that would go on there like like that. Okay. Inside the floor. Right, right. <laughs> so this this locks in the place. Somehow. Oh, this big thing here goes around these here. This big thing here goes around this. That's how it locks in the place. Okay. So what I meant was that goes down over that. Okay. That's that's what spins. This looks like a piece of cardboard here. Okay. So this goes on first. 
then it, it, it has to fall in place down here. So just spin it until it falls into place. Let's see. The other one we had, it had to be locked. Yeah, it, it, it kind of catches there. Okay. And then this would go on top of this. this. And then you put some food in, in there. And, and this slides in the place. And then that's what these are for. These go inside that slot. And if you don't have it set up right, it's not going to turn on. Okay, so let's go over to the uh, power here and try it. This short cord won't, won't even reach the wall over here. Okay. That's high. Here's, here's low. Seems the same to me. Okay. But see how if that's not, if, if that isn't in that slot right, she ain't going to turn off. Okay, that slot has to be back for it to turn on. Okay, mm -hmm. uh, let's go ahead and try it out with an apple. First, first we have to wash it. <laughs> Does it say if it's dishwasher safe? Should be. <clears throat> okay, I, I got a uh, apple chopped up here. You're gonna cut up the skin too? <laughs> yeah. Well. See how it's not the, it's not getting the stuff there at the top. Yeah, that's probably okay. what, what the little spatula is so, for. So here's here's the uh, magic trick. Watch. Okay. And uh, she found a drizzle hole here. There, there's a hole here in the top. Where you can, look like if you're making some, something there, there, there's like a a round cup here built into the top that you can pour stuff in, and it'll run down inside. Sometimes when you're crushing stuff up, it gets a little dry and it won't mix. Okay, see ya, bye.